130 cats and only three litter boxes were discovered in a Cox Cove home. What began as an assessment of a home reportedly housing a few dozen cats ended in the discovery of an extreme cat hoarding situation in a small town on the west coast of Newfoundland. Janice Higgins, president of Scaredy Cat Rescue in Corner Brook, Newfoundland, says she and other volunteers discovered at least 100 cats during a routine visit in a home in Cox Cove. We discovered cats that are malnourished, that are suffering severe flea infestations, Higgins told CBC's St. John Morning Show. I'm surprised at the amount of ear mite dirt that a small kitten's ear canal can hold. Higgins said that she first learned of the situation after a veterinary clinic in Corner Brook asked if the group could investigate. According to Higgins, the woman who lives in the home only has three litter boxes for the mass of felines. She said the owner feeds the cats by taking a handful of kibble and throwing it onto the floor. Higgins said 60 cats have been removed from the home, but she fears the owner will end up in the same situation down the road. She is very concerned about her privacy right now and the embarrassment that this has caused, Higgins said. She doesn't want to be known throughout the town or the province as a hoarder. A similar situation played out in Corner Brook in 2012 when over 100 cats were discovered in the home on McWister Lane. After numerous complaints to the city from neighbors about the smell coming from the home, the city had to demolish it. We don't know how many hoarding situations there are. It happens behind closed doors. The people become isolated. They don't allow people into their homes and it escalates, Higgins told CBC News. 